how I like to do throw line management. Uh, I have usually a bag of throw line 100 200 feet depending on the tree or the ropes rope length I'm using or the rope systems I'm using. I'll tie a slip knot about 25 to 40 feet down on it so that if I miss with a in tree throw the whole thing doesn't pay out of the bag. This will depend on how long the ropes are that I'm using where I tie this and also how long my average throws are in the tree. To coil it, I use a figure eight around my pinky and thumb. And I worked a lot with both hands. That really increases the speed. Then when I get down to the end, or when I'm ready, I've got about this much on my hand, I pinch the center so the coils don't come undone. And then the side that goes in the bag goes down goes into the bag first. That'll keep them from getting too tangled when it comes back out of the bag. And then of course the end never goes in the bag because otherwise that'll inevitably form a knot or so.